Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Gemini um, for mid-November 2019. Gemini. You have a positive new beginning here, Gemini. It sounds like you have been letting go a lot. You are clearing the past, the old, opening your heart, letting go. Gemini, um, hmm, okay. You do have a positive new beginning. It looks to me that you have been disappointed with someone. They played games on you, lied to you, betrayed you. You can't commit because you are loving yourself at this time. That person... They are humiliated in some way. You did something. You did something like, you know, just to uh, let go to, or to tell this person, um, it's over between us. You are telling them, like you are telling him or her, I let go. This is someone who kept really coming back and forth. They, they believe in you so much. They value you really a lot also. They think that you are confident, you are beautiful, you are sexy, you are hot, you are all that. This person knows that he or she disappoints you very much. They feel very, very guilty. This person is at loss. This person feel they, they are losing you at this time completely, 100%. They have a lot of emotions for you. There is a lot of insecurity. You have a lot of insecurity also. Not a lot, actually, on Gemini. Okay, that's why I kept quiet. So I'm seeing here three Geminis. One, you Gemini, another Gemini, and another Gemini. It's showtime. Let's deal with this. Okay, Gemini, there is a person here in relation that he or she it seems to be an ex-husband. This person betrayed you, okay? But this person love you. I don't know how someone you love you and does that to you. You know, it's not really even true or right. It doesn't work like that, okay? This person, they have been trying to work it out between you and him, back and forth, back and forth in relationship between you two. And uh, they have been dishonest. It sounds to be here that they are, they are missing you. They feel like, you know, it just uh, isolated. Uh, they feel uh, unwelcome in your home. They want more with you. They, they are not happy. They are not comfortable at this time. You are very, very disappointed. You still have love for this person in your heart. And you know that you can get him or her back. You have been really back and forth a little bit. You don't know what to do. Your mind is telling you no. 
It's not going to work. And this person is not going to learn their lesson. Your heart is telling you, go for it. You are in between a little bit. So you have been really going through the emotions at this time. This person, the ex, they have love for you a lot. They feel humiliated lately. You did something. You find out about a lie. Someone is involved with your ex. Told you that she or he, like your ex, have a have a, a girlfriend that. She tried to talk to you that she is family with him and and uh, she she's gonna marry him and want him but there are some lies here that the girlfriend said it could go for a man or a woman you know it could be a boyfriend or a girlfriend okay but it sounds here that they told you that we are family together we're gonna get married and we are together but your ex doesn't want this person in marriage. The ex like no wish that they come back to you and work it out with you. And that person with your ex is a Gemini also. That's you Gemini. The girlfriend or the boyfriend is a Gemini with your ex. So that's two Geminis. There is another Gemini that you love the most that you have been really waiting for. This person is coming. See this? This is a new relationship with Gemini and there is happiness, love, excitement, beautiful thing is going to happen. This person is still coming. I know you are disappointed that this person never spoke or they give you hints or something like that, but it feels to me that they are holding on you. And this person have a relationship with someone else. That's the person you love. That doesn't mean that you still don't love your ex. Let's isolate the ex here because the ex, the, the ex little bit, okay. Let's start with the ex again, sorry. The ex knows that there is nobody like you, you know. They want you, they, they love you, they want to be with you. But the on and off, between you two has been really like, you know, going, wow, you know, crazy. This person is on addiction. It could be, excuse me. It could be alcohol, uh, drugs, anything like that, but mostly alcohol. They are just, vaccinating their body and I feel the ex is sick with something that they need to check with the doctor because they are having bad bad luck like you know just it seems to be that they they need to visit a doctor they are the ex is thinking about it you have been really working you have been professional and your work is really going to really be very good also you are attracting business at this time. Business is going to be very good. The one you are in love with that they are coming in, in the picture, they are involved with someone else yet afraid to leave them. Let's see about the Gemini, the girlfriend with your ex, because it sounds here that there is a game has been played on you. But uh, before I start this, like, you know, you and, and the ex, like, you, know, you are stressed out a little bit here. You want to change things with, with your ex if you want to take them back. But you kind of, like, you know, undecided back and forth. You are going through a lot at this time. And you feel like if they lie to you, you're going to fight with them. So you need to calm your emotions. This person, the ex, like, you know, holding on you and he, they still want you. But you are doubting. Your ex see the light. It's like they had epiphany. 
they can separate from everything like you know and and be with you but they want to make sure that you will take them back and you are not really going back and forth he or she are really, really very mad but you have been hurting a lot and every time you want to do something you can you you want to come and grab them it feels to you here that your ego standing in the way why I'm the one who's going to do all the work and he or she is not going to do it. Let's ask about this girlfriend for your ex. And she or he are a Gemini person too. Um, The person who's involved with the ex, they love. This person, they love their, your ex very much. Your ex loves you. And they cannot make a decision about this uh, woman or man. Okay. They are back and forth. And if you are not dealing with the ex at this time, the ex is dealing with another person beside that woman. Okay. Why you want the ex, Gemini? Okay, it's not my business to be judgmental about people, but it sounds here that you need to really think before you act. This person, the girlfriend or the boyfriend for your ex, they are giving gifts, you know, money. They are helping the ex just for them, like not to stay with them. The ex is selfish here. They are taking advantage of this person. And it, say, it sounds here like you know, there are... I see pills, medications, it could be drugs, it could be something they are doing. Uh, you know, I, I'm not really getting that. It's kind of like you no know, fun activity for them at this time. This person like you know, who loves the ex, they keep turning in the same circle over and over. Let's do this, let's, uh, let's bring like, you know... Um, don't go back. They don't want them to go back with you. The ex feels like, you no, know, really, this is a positive new beginning. They are lucky because, you know, this person is taking care of them at this time. They are getting, like, you know, their motive, whatever they want. Okay. But this person doesn't understand your ex. They are trying to block you, the wife or the, the boyfriend, which is you, Gemini, which is the other person is Gemini too, to keep you away. They don't want you to be in the picture. It seems to be that they called you, this person, the boyfriend or the girl, girlfriend of your ex called you and tried to show you that they went on a trip, they did this, they did that show you some pictures just to make you jealous, keep you off the picture, maybe threatening you in a way, maybe a, a slight one, okay? So you can let go your ex and you won't come closer. The ex knew about this and you called the ex and say like, you know what, best of luck, leave me alone. I'm happy that you are happy and you wanted to close this. So it sounds to be that, you know, this boyfriend or girlfriend for your ex, they are trying to fulfill their wishes. They are trying to make them happy. The ex like to pretend that they are happy with them. They are just stalling time. They want to move in together. Maybe they are moving temporary somewhere. This person love your ex very much. They are, they do. They really love them. But they are really mad at each other. They fight a lot. She or he grabbing on the ex really very much also. They are trying to make you jealous very much. Spying on you. Spying on your ex also. Fighting arguments. She or he that, 
who's involved with your ex is really very negative. Negative, like you no know, negative about too many things. Like you no, know, they have bad habits a lot. But it sounds here the ex, like you know that, want the relationship with them, but they are afraid. They are afraid. They don't want to make a decision. Like you no, know, they are not making a decision, and the person who's involved with the ex afraid, afraid to be with this relationship. Like they want this relationship so badly, but they are also afraid to move forward. Because the ex lies a lot and cheat, and they don't trust them. Let's about, uh, talk about the, the one that you want, dear Gemini. I hope this is not confusing for everybody, because three Geminis. So, Gemini. The person that you are in love with, never you never been with, which is a Gemini person as yourself. For other people, it could be a Leo, it could be a Libra, it could be a Pisces also. Um, it doesn't have to be like a Gemini person, but I'm picking on another Gemini here beside you. Um, you feel like you know, that this person, you wish to be with them, you love them, but you have a lot of emotions here and you find that maybe I should or shouldn't be with this person because they, he, he or she still have family and you don't want to be the home wrecker. Okay. It looks to me also here that you are really, you are moody about it. Sometimes you feel that you think about this person so much and sometimes you don't want nothing to do with them. This person took a long time and they are still not really saying anything, but they show you the love. Um, it seems to be that this person is focused on their work. You are focusing on your work. It has been slow in the past. Now it's really progressing. This person, like you know that, they haven't been hearing from you. No calls, no messages, nothing. Usually in the past, long time ago, you used to do something or call. Sometimes they feel you very much, sometimes you don't. You wanted this to happen really very fast, but it never did. So you felt that you spent a lot of time, energy with this person, and you felt like you know, that you want to give it away or give it up because you have been hurting emotionally. Um, this person, you are going to be surprised at this month, like a week, maybe a week, one week. Or it could be like as soon as possible, kind of like something as soon as possible, they are going to be just opening up. They will say something to you. And you thought that maybe it's over. I'm not going with it. It's not gonna happen. It's just because you are distracted now and you don't wanna do, do anything, it's gonna happen. And you felt suddenly like, you know, maybe this is a waste of time and energy. Let me move on. This is not going to happen. I don't want to slow down myself or block myself because you thought that this person had been blocking you. So you feel that you want to walk away from him or her. You try to change your direction and suddenly, boom, they are coming. This person, the other Gemini that you want, they are coming. You have been lonely and you seek a relationship and you kept being like you know, having these fears back and forth about contacting or reaching out for the ex, but it seems to be that you're going to change your mind about the ex. You are worried also about the other person in this Gemini, the one you are in love with. There is a female, 
It could be a man also. It comes for a man or a woman. You're worried that if you get involved with this person, you're going to get in trouble with something. Like if you are working and this person working with you, the other person is going to get you out of your job, out of your living, where you live, because it sounds to be like, you know, this person is someone with authority. Don't fear this person, like, you know, the other person info involved with them. The one you love, have someone they are involved with. Do not be afraid of them. Take your fear off. You will have a new relationship with this person is coming. I see it coming. You put on yourself like, you know, as, like, you know, that's it. I want to be alone. I don't want relationships. I want to pay attention to my work. But it looks to me that you're going to get this relationship. If you have a business or work, like, you know, it seems to be that is going to progress really a lot. You're going to be busy. You have been struggling with working because you have been going with the emotions the whole year, you know, back and forth with the ex. Emotional for this one, like, you know, that you are in love with and they never come forward. But it looks to me there is a lot of happiness, confident relationship and money also. But I'm looking at money is going to be really so good. And I see that this person that you have been waiting for, they're going to speak up. I hope you like the reading, dear Gemini. And uh, if you need a private reading, please contact me on mysticalaziza.com. Thank you. Bye.